Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be walking you through EarPost Kit, which is a product I recently launched to make it super easy to post your Doberman ears in minutes. EarPost Kit was created to help Doberman owners quickly post their Doberman ears with our pre-made handcrafted ear posts. Previously, Doberman owners had to resort to purchasing different materials to create their own ear posts and spent a lot of time and money during the trial and error process. And with EarPost Kit, customers now don't need to worry about creating their own ear posts. They can simply order an EarPost Kit with 10 or 30 pairs of ear posts that are already made and ready for posting. Alright guys, so the rest of the video I'm going to show you how to use your post kit and just walk you through how easy the process is for posting. Alright, so I guess we're going to be starting um, to post her ear. So we're going to grab the backer rod that's already prepared. So what I'm going to do first is to just measure the backer rod, pulling up the ear and then inserting, insert, inserting the back of rod all the way in, and then just trying to get a sense of where it it comes. So for her, it's like right there. So I'm just gonna take this and I'm just gonna cut it. All right, so that should be the right size. All right, so this is for the right ear. Um, now I just I'm just gonna measure um, the left ear. So again, you're gonna pull the ear up insert the back of rod there, make sure it's tight, keep pulling the ear up, and then just measure it. So it's about here. I'm gonna go ahead and cut that. All right, so there we have it, right? We have your two back of rods that are already um, cut and prepared. Hey girl, come here, come on, come on, okay. Yes, good girl. All right, so for step two, we're gonna use your Zonus tape and we're gonna tape your back of rod with the sticky side up. So this part is super important because we want the tape to stick to the other tape we're gonna be using in the other step and using the sticky side up just makes it more stickier and just more secure in your Doberman's ears. So check it out and see how I'm using the tape and just, basically flipping it over and then just going down the back of rod with the sticky side up. And now we're gonna be cutting three pieces of Zonus tape. So we have our Zonus tape here. So we're gonna do a small size, a medium size, and then a large size. So let's start with the small size. So for the tip of the ear, so we'll do that. Um, and then we'll do the middle one. As you can see, it's a little bit longer. And then we're gonna do um, one that's for uh, the base of the ear which is going to be a little bit longer for sure. Just going to cut it there. And then there you have it. So Evie, sit. Good girl. Yes. Good girl. Good girl. All right. So this is the fun part. So just grab your back of rod. Again, pull it back up and then insert it in a circular motion. So make sure you're holding the ear and the back of rod up. And so now we're going to grab our middle tape and then we're just going to tape it in the middle of the ear and I'm going towards the front of the ear, looping towards the back and just making sure um, that the structure of her ear is still, still the same, right? I'm not, I'm not pulling the tape so much that it's, um, you know, changing uh, the way that her, her ear stands. So once I do the middle part, I'm going to go do the base of the ear and then the base just start from the bottom of the base oh, looks like it's not as sticky 
So make sure the tape is sticky and keep holding the ear up. And just wrap it around. Make sure it is taped up nicely. And then grab the last one. This is for the tip. So it's gonna go somewhere here. And just make sure it is secure. All right, so good girl. <laughs> she gets a treat. Um, cool, so let's go ahead and post the other one. So again, we're gonna pull her ear. We're gonna insert the back rod all the way in, keep pulling the ear up, and then you're just gonna hold it from the tip right there. You're gonna grab the middle tape, gonna put it right there in the middle, and then just wrap around towards the front of the ear, and then go back and just make sure it's secure. Again, keep holding up the ear. So that's there. And then you're gonna do the base of the ear. So start from the bottom, make sure it's sticky. And then, oh, whoops. So, gotta go from the bottom towards the front, and then loop again towards the back. All right, keep holding the ear, and then you're gonna do the front, sorry, the, the, the top of the ear. It's okay, Evie, come on. It is definitely hard to do this on your own, so if you can grab a friend to help you with the posting, it definitely helps. So as you can see, you know, we, we got the ear posts, they're in, um, just make sure it's secure. Good girl, Evie. Nice, nice, good girl. All right, so yeah, just make sure it's secure. We're actually securing it with our bridge. Um, so what I wanna do is I wanna measure the bridge and see if it's, if it's you know, um, correctly at the position that I want her ears to stand. It looks like it needs a little bit off, so I'm just gonna cut a little bit here. All right, so you want the ears to stand at um, 11 and then a one o'clock uh, positions. So you can see that's what it looks like. So now I'm gonna grab the piece of Zonus tape here. And then this is where I just use the long tape. So just cut enough to wrap around the ears twice. So that's enough. All right, I'm gonna grab my chicken here. Evie, here. Yes, come here, girl. Come on, come on, come on. What's that? Okay. Oh yes, good girl. All right, so Evie, sit. All right, good girl. Okay, cool. So what I'll do here is just grab the, the, the bridge, put it right in the middle there then just tape it up like this. And now this is where I'm gonna be basically securing it, right? So grab the bridge, just tape it like this. And then grab the other ear. So make sure it's in the position that you want it to be. And then just wrap around like this. Make sure it's sticky in the middle where the bridge is. And then wrap around again. And then just secure the tape. Good girl, yes. Good girl. All right. Um, so another thing, if, if you wanna be extra secure, what I like to do is just cut a little piece right here, which I'm gonna use for the middle of the bridge so it doesn't come out. So as you can see here, I'll just pretty much go ahead and tape it in the middle just so it could be secure because I'm pretty sure she's gonna try to take these off later. So as you can see, um, the bridge is in place. 
um, and it is pretty secure. There you go. So um, that's pretty much it. It's pretty easy to post with your posts that are already created. And so um, we hope to help even more Dobermans with the ear posting process. So feel free to check us out um, at earpostkit.com and please subscribe to our channel and make sure you hit that like button for us um, and for UV as well. Good girl.